so the bags are stapled shut. It has condiments. Applesauce. And a muffin. Um That's what I get for breakfast every day, I guess. I got my little two orange juices. Have a good day, guys. Stay safe. So, here we are again. Uh, one more car showed up last night. I think it's for that hotel, though. So, got my orange juice in the bag. There are actually three other vehicles here. So, not the only one. Good morning, guys. So, it is Hank and I's um, seven year wedding anniversary. He's gone and working. I need to look outside. Oh, it's not that bad, good. There was, there was some crazy weather last night. I mean, the house was shaking, the wind was blowing. It was like, something's going to go, go down, something's gonna go down. And we have huge trees in our backyard. So I'm always, always worried that the trees are gonna fall on our house, but it's all good. Um, it seems like a lot of people around here have quite a bit of wind damage. Um, but from what I can see from my windows, everything's fine. There's no shingles on the grass. So I think we're okay. Um, I'm really bummed out that Hank's not here. We had big plans. We were going to this resort um, up north, that was an indoor, uh, it was like an indoor island. There was palm trees and sand and like beach pools. It was really, really cool. And uh, it was on the beach, but COVID took us out. So we're not doing that. It's so pretty outside. Like, look at all that. Mm, I love it. Uh, I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'm not really hungry right now, so I'm gonna wait a minute. But I need to clean up the mess. I went to bed a little after two in the morning and I baked bread last night. I baked sweet Hawaiian rolls last night. Um, and I ate four of them. <laughs> that was my dinner, I guess. And I had some candy. That's my problem, it gets late and I get a little snacky poo. I was making a half a cup of grits and it turned into like five cups and I even like lessened down what they said. I'm glad I didn't make one cup of freaking grits. All right, so I'm making breakfast. This was literally, I, I even lessened the recipe to a half cup of grits. This is literally like once I added the water and it had less water. Like, I like my grits creamy, and these were, like, hard. So I'd add more water, and now it's, like, five cups of grits. I don't know. I did what they said, but I didn't like what they said. You know, playing in the kitchen again. I'm making a cup of coffee. I had some leftover dough from yesterday, and a, cup, a little bit of it got hard because I didn't have a proper bag to put it in. So I made vegan donuts. They're not the best. I'm not a donut maker. I'll give you that. But I... I, don't, I feel like everyone always asks, did you record it? Did you, what's the recipe? I never record anything I make because half the time I make it and I might, you know, I might never make it again or I don't think it's good enough to share a recipe. And that's with those donuts. It's not good enough, but all right. I'm trying to make some espresso to go with my grits and I'm gonna butter up one of these rolls. And that's what's gonna be breakfast. Grits and a piece of bread and coffee. It's 11 a.m. and the mail just came and that's crazy. The mail came before the trash came. So I guess they got more mailman out. I would think they'd have to just because it's kind of like Christmas, you can't go anywhere. So you gotta buy everything online. I'm gonna go check the mail.
All right, my kitchen is a complete disaster, but I'm cleaning out my pantry now. I haven't seen the floor in forever. <laughs> and I find it, I'm finding like a lot of repeats that are both open, so I'm putting them in the same bag. There was pop in here that exploded on the floor, so I'm gonna try to clean that up. Um, and I don't, <laughs> the, pop, the pop's been sitting in here probably for, I don't know, a year, year and a half. It's, something called Shasta. I think it's like Dollar Tree Pop. I'm not really sure. I think it's for like mixers for his drinks. Anyways, it's a big stain on the floor now. So I'm gonna open up the rest of my soy milk, stick it in there. And then I'm just trying to like layer out the shelves. All my dried goods always stay on top. And then hanky snackles. And then down here is gonna be like some soy milk and bulk items on the floor. It's hot in the house, actually. Surprising. There's a, not a hurricane, a tornado warning or tornado. You can hear the thunder. You have to hear the thunder. So I'm gonna close up the shed. I don't have a basement. I'm not too worried. I'm more worried about the trees falling. Oh, the rain's starting. Oh my gosh. All right. It's hailing. <laughs> oh, okay. Can you hear it? Oh, it's not big yet. They're saying golf ball size. It's coming down now. I don't see a funnel yet. They're saying it's six o'clock till night for tornado warnings. Ooh. You have to be able to hear that. It's coming down. Oh, it's big ones. Look at that. Storm tracers, right? It's coming from this direction. This way. Alright, let's get back inside. Oh, it's gonna kill my flowers. <gasps> Alright, I'm closing the door. <laughs> Update, I washed all my counters down so they look good. I got espresso little things. I changed a filter in the espresso machine and I wiped my cabinets down again so they look better. I'm gonna go back out because the storm has passed and I'm gonna open up the, oh, the celly shed again so my tomato plants can get some sun. I think I'll be doing this all day back and forth storm will come. I did a little bit more rearranging. I I want something long enough that fits underneath that window. Like this is perfect, but I need more counter space in my kitchen. It's just it's really annoying not having any counter space. This is literally just that and that's it for counter space. So that's coming back.